crunching hit there reverberates around the rink by Nathan Plessis. Sean Farrell trying to flip it ahead for Alex LaField, Connecticut. Now a retreat in their own end as they reload the power play. Mason Langenbrunner for holding. Poke checked away, maybe a chance shorthanded. Sean Farrell busting in left circle. And the shot deflected wide. Sting was taken off of it. A good recovery there by Schlott just to sort of force Farrell out on the angle so that he couldn't get a clean look away. And Bottrell who drew the penalty. Sutton to the point here for Monroe. Monroe trying to do a pirouette around LaFerrier. Off the apron of the net. Sean Farrell will settle things down. Harvard gets some reinforcements piling into the play. Set up the umbrella. Seedham. Left circle. Coronado tipped in front. They score. Alex LaFerrier on the door. And he is into the zone like a rocket. And he got a piece of that clearance pass. That set up the first try by Thrun. And then as Harvard completes its change to get the whole power play unit on the ice, Brown ends up in a situation where they're... Harvard strikes early on the power play. Mason Langenbrunner maneuvers through center. Lost the handle. It's back with Coronado. Joe Miller. Go cross ice. Snapped off the tape of Sean Farrell. Jack Barr closing. Trying to pass it. Knocked around in front. Coronado on the loose change. Coronado spun down the corner. Was brought down by Tony Andriozzi. He shot through to make its way through the turbulence. Harvard able to keep it in. Sean Farrell walking in and just wide. One of Harvard's maybe underrated attributes. And what circle to circle. Farrell off the crossbar and in. LaFerriere once again explosive scoring his second power play goal. To an outstanding start, two for two. Just a beautiful feed again. LaFerriere working that bumper position. And Harvard just utilizes that triangle around the top. They force the penalty killer side to side, side to side. And they wait until that window opens. And what for Miller put back in front, scrambling around Karan. And he makes the save in pure desperation. See them. Miller right in front, couldn't quite pull it around, just out of his reach, but any play by Coronado, he just pumps it back through the crease, almost knocks it in off Caron, and then with Caron still down, Farrell tries to lift it upstairs, doesn't get enough on it, and Caron just has to sprawl out and get a whistle. Gar tried to move it, went off the glove of Chris, shorthanded here is Farrell, Farrell cutting in, and a great... This way for Farrell. Waiting for an opening. Back to Seedham. Final 10 seconds. Brown hemmed in here. Great toe save made by Karan as Seedham able to get it through traffic. Power play comes to an end. De facto for the moment. Sean Farrell, a little shake and bake. High slot turns. Goes high off the glass. Popped out in front to center. Brown able to hold up as here comes Tonelli. Tonelli on the way through. Lost the handle. Henry Theron did just enough. Frantic, frenetic pace. Harvard right back in. Sean Farrell to Jack Barr. He was surrounded immediately. And it's taken away. Was 18th in scoring in the North American Hockey League last year. Looking to put a big imprint for Matt Coronado. Two on two. Shorthanded rush. Over to Sean Farrell. Farrell with a step. He scores. He sneaks it through. A shorthanded goal. First of the year for Farrell. Harvard regains the three-goal lead. Uh, just like that, the tide turns back the other direction. Farrell's had a dynamite first two games. Felt like he was certainly due for his first goal of the season. And he gets it in pretty harmless fashion, right? Caron has the angle. Farrell just finds a little crease. And I'm sure that's what Caron would tell you he should have more often than not. 